Does your puppy jump all over you, your family, and your guests? Do you worry about what's gonna happen when you open up your front door? If so, you know I got you. Let's go over three quick tips to try at home to help curb some of the jumping. The first thing to try is if your dog is toy motivated, have a good squeaker toy on hand. The key to this working extra well is if the toy is novel, meaning that your dog doesn't see it in any other context. Have this novel toy outside ready for the person entering to grab on their way in. And the second they get through that door, they can squeak it, get your puppy interested in it, and then toss it. And hopefully your puppy will run after the toy to play with that instead of jumping all over the person. The second thing to try is if your dog is food motivated. Have some treats near your front entryway or near the front door, and that way your guests can grab some on their way in. They can use those treats to toss away from them and ask your puppy to go find it, or they can use the food to reward any good behavior like your puppy standing with all four paws on the floor. The third thing you can try is give your dog an activity to do the second the person enters your home. This could be a puzzle toy, a food stuffed toy, or a long lasting chew that they like. Aside from these three tips, if you feel like your puppy is very, very determined to jump up a lot, you might wanna rely a little bit more on management here. This means giving them something to do inside of their crate, behind the gate, in their playpen, in another section of the home, or even just leashing them and keeping them at a distance, rewarding any good behavior, of course, until they're calmer and then we can do our greetings. Final note here, long term, we really wanna focus on replacing behaviors that we don't like so much. This could be in the form of teaching your dog something like going to their place when someone's coming in, like a bed or a mat, or even just rewarding them for all four paws on the floor. So follow these tips and hopefully you'll turn your little jumping bean into a more polite greeter.